hello guys we are into our 20th session now and uh, today's discussion will be about how to conduct a clinical trial now the clinical trial scenario in india looking upon a little of the history it was in the first decade of 21st century when many challenges were uh, Uh, uh faced due to the regulatory reforms so the main challenges of the investigators were delayed approval quality of ethics review shipment of samples overall deficiency of trained investigators and uh, confusions of compensation even for clinical trials and the requirement of regulation uh, requirement of audio visual recordings of the consent process so uh, these are uh, different uh, bodies uh, under each type of uh, review like in the scientific review we have the institutional scientific advisory committee and icmr ethical review icmr and national ethics committee regulatory review is the health ministry sex screening committee drug controller general of india genetic engineering approval committee and uh, addressing to the ethical issues we have to see whether uh, there is any mechanism for independent ethical review which mechanism exists to ensure the protection of the human subjects and whether there is a uh, proper adequate uh, community engagement and support whether there is informed consent standard of care is provided and if, if there is use of placebos uh, uh, was that uh, causing any harm to the participants and how the confidentiality is being protected some of the critical issues includes the informed consent procedure screening and enrollment strict adherence to the inclusion and exclusion criteria good clinical and labor laboratory practice quality control and quality assurance adherence to the interven intervention and follow up multicentric trials to have a standardization of the study protocol second thing is that there should be independent monitoring safety assessment should be there reimbursements compensation and grievance redressal should be done trial stoppage rules should be followed and documentation archival should be there at the level of patients they do not know about the clinical trials they do not have access may be afraid cannot afford or maybe want to go against the healthcare providers wishes at the level of healthcare providers there would be lack of awareness and unwilling to lose control of a patient's care to believe that the standard therapy is the best they believe uh, to be concerned that clinical trials add administrative burdens so all these things we have to keep in mind before conducting a clinical